orange. <laughs> uh, Bill just said everything he sees is orange. So yeah, with my orange sunglasses. That's why you know, like the blue Abba bleed do blue song. I know what song you guys are talking about. So uh, Bill showed up. Um, so that's good. I need I need a little bit of help. He had to feed my dog. He had to feed his dog. He said, his uh, crazy dog, dog. <laughs> and the mom. So I told Bill what we're doing, man. Uh, he agreed. It's simple. So we're going to get this uh, transmission and this transfer case off very easily. I got my rubber gloves. Oh, God. He said he's protected. He brought his condoms. I brought my condom gloves. Uh, let's see if we can. And somebody stole my white rag a second time this week, and I'm pissed. <laughs> they stole my white rag. stole your rag. Stole Two of my white rags. rags. I'll be right back, guys. Yeah. Somebody, now, now I have a red rag. I think somebody stole it, though. I lost my red rag. Oh, there it is. God, I lost it, too. I got it. I had to grab Mentora. I got my got red, red rag. rag. Nice. I had to go get Mentora. I'm getting tired of people stealing my, I didn't even get to use them. That damn rag, those rags. I always lose it before I get to use it. I had another one that someone left on my, on my snowboard, but I, I didn't want that one. I threw that one around. Gave it away? Did, what, well, smaller it was, or something? I uh, find out what size this is. I put it over here. I had a feeling it was a 15. Um, first one went right on, so I'm going to look for a socket. I prefer to use six point sockets, you don't strip off bolts. Um, that's my recommendation, or at least an open, you know, a ratchet like this. I recommend them so you don't strip them out. There you go. So. Yeah, those are neat. I've never seen anything like that. Yeah, those are cool. Um, so I'm gonna grab a jack, put the jack underneath it. Is there gonna be fluids coming out? Of I this? have no idea. I don't think so. Actually, yes, it will. It will. Because uh, fluid goes from the trans to the transfer you got, case. You got some buckets? I do. Uh, it, uh, I do. We don't want to make a mess. So, I'm you getting ready. Yeah. I'll get them under there. There you go. You want me to get you a cart? If you want, I don't know. Sure. If you a think little you, wheel cart? If you think it will help, Bill. All right. I want to go home and get a cart. I'm trying to remember where I put my oil bucket. Here it is. There you go. Yep. Hopefully it's uh I might have to get a different one. This one might be tall. This one might be too tall. You ain't got a lower one, do you? The what? One that it's a low profile. This one? Yeah. I'll go get one. I don't think this is gonna be uh low enough. I'm gonna grab this. Grab a cart. Yeah. So this transfer case, I gotta get underneath it. Actually, I just thought about that. I gotta get these rubber bolts. Actually, there's one right here and one right here. Which leaves a spacer on the bottom, I think, which I think we're gonna do it that way. About to find out. socket. It is this one though. There we go. That's what I needed. That's a torque wrench. These are always handy. You gotta have these. I had to find a regular ratchet though. That's Bill. Actually made me a toolbox. Mentora's over here trying to uh, help me over here. Play kitty. Do you want to work? You want to wrench, Mentora? I got. I got to get this off tonight, man. It's mandatory. 
I need an extension. I need a 3 8 ratchet. There you go. Bam. Ready to go. Right now I'm gonna try to uh actually I don't need the I don't need the extension. Just need the socket. Lefty loosey righty tighty, so I'm upside down. It should be this way. Maybe. I think that's tightening it. Yeah. I'm gonna have to grab a bar. <clears throat> Where's my chair? I'm gonna need this. I'm gonna go grab my torch. I'll be right back. I'm gonna have to heat these bolts up a little bit. You don't need much heat, and there's there's metal, but I mean there's rubber underneath it, so I don't want to start a fire or anything. I'm just trying to heat the head where it's going into that spacer, because that's the only part that's going in, you know, that's holding on to that metal. I want to crack them and get them loose before I get this transfer case off. Yeah. Gotta use this bar, man. All right, that's how you do it. Should do the other side, but the other side would be kind of a bitch to get to them. So I had to think about it for a second. These bolts coming out. I think I just smashed my finger. Always get hurt, man. I should be wearing gloves. Most guys will tell you gloves are for pussies, yeah, until you fucking fuck your shit up. And you fucking takes fucking three weeks to, you know, fucking heal your finger, and you can't work because your fucking finger hurts. You can't squeeze on anything because it's sore. But yet you don't have to wear gloves. That's why I got a lot of scars. Wear gloves. I need to go put a pair on, as I'm telling you to wear gloves. Always wear safety glasses if you're cutting, all that shit, man. You know, be safe, man. I've seen a lot of shit. I've seen people lose fingers, running. Fuck, I worked in the metal industry, man. I ran a multi-million dollar company. Um, you know, Ferris, they sold it for 750 million. You know, I was in charge of 300 people at one time, you know. Um, I was, I was, <laughs> your boy is getting paid. You know, I was making 1,600 a week. You know, sometimes 2,000 a week. A week. Bring it home, Bubba. Listen, that's a lot of serious cash. I was, I was somebody. All right, your boy knows what he's talking about. Your boy know what he's doing. All right. This one should be good. Heat is definitely going to help with that one. I'm going to have to put the bar on it, just like the other one. I can get in there with the heat. So we're good. And I stink. I'm farting like a motherfucker, man. It's that coffee. I got to drink more water. I didn't drink enough water today. 
I slept half the day, man, not having caffeine. I was I was in there, man. I was feeling if I was fucked up. I gotta cut down on my caffeine intake because I'm not gonna be gonna drink that much caffeine on the boat, you know? Um this fuck. I'm gonna have to heat this up and crank on it by hand. And then I go farting again. I told you I got gas. Bad. Probably gonna have to uh use the bathroom. Stop the video. That's why they call it Life Stories Perspectives. I ain't editing that out. That's too much flame. There we go. Ain't trying to burn down the transmission. Just heat up that bolt. This is called faith, so you know. Listen, people ain't calling because the shit ain't apart. God wants it apart. People need the shit apart. Once it's apart and I have it listed, it will sell. Promise you. That's fact. It's called faith. That's why I'm doing it. And I smell those cats through the ground. All those cats that died on me. All right, I gotta figure something else out. This this ratchet ain't long enough for me to grab onto. Um, so I'm gonna have to use this. I have to try to use this. And either I gotta find an adapter. I should have one. I know I have one. It's just finding it. we are find a big uh, socket that's 15, 17. That's what I'm gonna have to do. That's probably what's my best bet is to find a socket that's got a big end. Uh, that one, uh, see the uh, ratchet snap. Bet you I busted my knuckle on that one that day. I don't remember that. Don't remember that day. I keep on grabbing that 17. Eighteen. Oh. I'm trying to think what's 15 millimeter. I know 9 sixteenths is 14 millimeter. There's a big 16. Another 15, that's just regular. Just regular 382. Um, I don't know, man. I can always try one of these. Looks like, what am I have to do? 15 with a swivel. And then a uh, extension, which I should have somewhere. Probably left it over there. Where is it at? I'm gonna attempt to use the swivel with an extension like this. Let's see what happens. Tell ya.
I'm about to just take the transfer case off. Oh, fuck this. I can get to the transfer case without it. I'm about to drop the oil, dude. The oil's about to go all over the ground and everything. I don't have time. Clean it up after. I'm not gonna get to that bolt. I have to make sure my Torah doesn't come around. Fold. Should probably disconnect all the wires to it. That would help. For some coffee, man. I need some more coffee. <laughs> I'm telling you, I run on coffee. I do. I drink a lot of coffee. It's in my blood. I love. I'm. I love coffee, dude. It's my favorite drug. Coffee and weed. My two favorite drugs. Sugar. Huh? All right, that's good. Cause I'm. I can't get to that bottom bolt on the uh, rubber on the trans mount, so. Got some special soap. Get the hands clean. Oh, and here goes my dumbass. Ha! Ah, I just fucked up. Big time. Here's an emergency pan. I'm an idiot. Small pan. You hear me? What? I gotta cut this bolt because I was talking, not paying attention. I backed it all the way out with this. What happened? I'm an idiot. That's what happened. No, no, no. What, what is it? Won't come out all the way? I backed it out too far, Bill. Don't worry about it. I'll take care of it. All right. So you see, my saw, so. see how it's done, so I know how to do it. No, just my dumbass ass backed this out too far, and oh, I'm on the, the wrench swivel. Won't. You can't get the wrench I off. I can't get the wrench off now. Like an idiot. Here. And you can't put it back in. Try it out with this. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna break. I'm gonna cut it. Try it out. I'm gonna fucking. I don't want to crack this aluminum. That's a special pry bar. You can do it. Dude, I'm telling you, I'm gonna. I don't know, not like that. Man. Listen though, but even I don't want to crack. Listen, I don't want. This is aluminum. Yeah. Listen, right, I'm gonna I'll, cut I'll the do bolt. It. I'll do it. You're gonna, I'm gonna cut it. This is why I said I want to do shit. Let me, let me try. Bill, I will, I'll be, I'll be very gentle. Bill, there's too much of a, there's not, there's not enough room to bend it out. Then I cracked it. Oh, well, I see what you're talking about. You're gonna crack it. I understand now. I just don't know the fuck I put my saws on it. I don't get where I went. I just had it too. Oh yeah, this wrench won't ratchet the other way. No, it won't ratchet the other way, so it's stuck. Yeah, that's why I never use those damn things. I wasn't paying attention. If I would have pulled it off and flipped the wrench in time, I would have been fine. Okay. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, it ain't no big deal. No, it's not, but I'm irritated because I can't find my fucking saws off. I just had that bitch. Here it is. I got a whole bunch of extra blades at home. We're probably going to need them, though, my dumb ass doing this shit. See, this shit, this is what you got to watch out for, man. You got to pay attention to what the fuck you're doing. Well, that, that'll run well, a job, problem. listen, I've, 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 I've turned a job, an hour job, into two day jobs before. Nah, it's just, it's just a little, I'm just saying an example. Just
Don't touch that. Yeah. You'll burn yourself. Burn your house. Oh. All right, back to uh, doing what I'm doing. Now you you can get the rest of it out with this thing. Yeah, that's a good idea. Thank don't you, don't use that damn tool no more. No, I use it. You just got to back it out. Well, <laughs> you got to take it off. Well, I was talking, Bill, not paying attention. Well, I would have done the same thing even if I paid attention. Oh, you ain't lying. Because... Huh? That, that kind of shit happens to everybody. Oh, yeah. Know? Well, that's why I'm recording it. Life ain't... That's why I never buy tools like that. <laughs> that's why I call it Life Stories Perspective. That's the kind that Ryan buys. Oh, yeah. I can't believe... Yeah. Bill just showed me the guy across the street. I don't like telling people's business, but... Man, this motherfucker took apart a car and rebuilt it in his garage, in his basement. Yeah. Like, who the fuck does that? That's crazy. Well, my, ma, my ma freaked out when I saw, showed her the picture. That's crazy. You, listen, How is he going to drive it out I'll of there? It out. Yeah. That's the whole point. You keep it down there. Ain't nobody stealing it. That's a Dodge. It's an old 60s Dodge Daytona or something. <laughs> it's worth a lot of money. That's the only reason why I'm telling everybody, because good luck getting it. You you're going to get shot going Dougie. in there. Huh? Reminds me of my friend, Dougie. <laughs> I went over to his house. That's awesome. He was in the bushes. What you doing in the bu <laughs> front bushes there, Dougie? Fucking weirdo. Uh, uh, and he, uh, 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 and Lord and behold, to my surprise, there it was, <laughs> a girl, laying on her stomach in the bump. bushes. Oh yeah. What her pants pulled down. Oh yeah. Oh, no, was what? No wait, it was her dress pulled up and her underpants pulled down. Uh. And Dougie was taking, doing something with a popsicle stick in her butt. That's fucking weird. And I said, what the oh, hell are you... Oh, no, I didn't swear in those days. I was a little boy. Said, what are you doing? <laughs> I said, I'm a doctor. <laughs> and I'm taking your temperature with this popsicle stick. <laughs> said, and, and you come on over here and pull your pants down, and we're going to do you next. I said, oh, no, you ain't going to put no damn pop... Oh, no, I didn't swear in those <laughs> days. You ain't gonna put no popsicle stick in my butt, and then, and then, his mother. She looked exactly like Mary Tyler Moore. <laughs> she was the most beautifulest Mary Tyler Moore duplicate I have ever saw. Drove a '64 Impala. That's uh, funny. Light blue. That's a nice oh, car. Oh, it was the most beautiful. And she used to take us for rides in it. I bet. In the back seat. I've been happy as Oh, it was like car. riding in a Cadillac limo. Scene. Oh, for sure. Oh, it was so nice. That sounds sweet. Anyway, she was. She heard my yapping away <laughs> saying oh, yeah, those you can't, strange things. You can't things. miss you and your fucking and mom. It caught her interest, and she'd come a-running. Mary Tyler Moore comes a-running. <laughs> and then it. Sorry, when she saw her son poking a little girl up the oh, ass with a popsicle stick and me standing there yeah, looking <laughs> like this. With your mouth open. <laughs> she said, Bill, go home. <laughs> and I ran home. I, I don't know what happened after that. I don't know Until a couple days later. I don't want to know. <laughs> Dougie says to me, hey, man, what you doing? <laughs> I don't know. That's good. Come on in. My mom wants to cook us lunch. Uh, cook you. Blah, 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 blah. blah. Tom, we were sitting at the table eating our lunch. And Dougie <laughs> says to me, Boy, oh boy, man, my mom just gave me, my mom gave me a whooping for doing that with that little girl. What did your mom do to you? And I was looking at her. I looked at his mom. <laughs> I had the same word. You think I'm going to, I just thought, what the, the hell are you going gonna do? Tell my mom, you put a popsicle stick a girl's butt, go give me a whooping? That ain't my style. No. I don't do shit like that. <laughs> and I could never figure out why he asked a stupid damn question like that in front of his ma. If anything, his ma should have given him another whooping for talking like talking that. Like but that. then you know what I figured it out. What's that? His ma wanted to know if I was a blabbermouth. Uh, oh, yeah, tell she, she had her little boy's reputation at stake. And, oh, I, yeah. and since I was stone quiet, she didn't everything know. was just fine. Oh, yeah, I mean. Yeah. 
My quiet said everything that they needed to know to ease their minds <laughs> because I was no talker. I don't like no telling on people. I've never told nope, on somebody. Not me. I ain't going to go tell, but I did tell my mom. There's a difference between a I told my and a rat, rat as well. I told my mom when I figured it out three my days ago. My whole family's ago, rats. Because I figured this all out. Fucked it up. took me till, till, I, till I was 65 to figure out why the hell did he ask me a stupid damn fool question like that. And it took me till I was 65 years old to figure out why he did that. Huh. His ma wanted to know if I was a blabbermouth. Oh, yeah, they want to I am that. now. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to blab, 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 For God, blab, blab, yeah, blab, for, blab. God for, yeah. sure. for Jesus, I'll blab anything. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, sure, boy. I blab mine. I just my wish I knew his last shirt. name, man. Who, the kid? Oh. Yeah, that, uh, maybe he's a senator or something. Yeah. Oh, oh. <laughs> this guy go going out. Stick it in your butt. Molesting little girls when he oh, was he's a little boy. He's, if he was molesting boys, he's definitely a senator. For oh. sure. He's definitely in the politics. What I don't understand. People are fucking, people why in politics. Why are they going after Trump? My sister said, oh, he had secret documents. Well, I got to get to this bolt, Phil. I need your help. All right. And this trans mount um, bolt is in the way, and it's the last bolt holding it on. What's holding it? What's in the way? This trans, this uh, trans mount bolt, right here. This last one, I can't get to it. This oh, down here, underneath. I tried with the swivel. I tried with an extension. I'm gonna have to jack up the side of the uh, frame, I think, to get to it. I'm not gonna see it. I'm gonna have to feel for it. You need a small, a shorter extension. You mean the socket? No, the extension. I tried a, I tried a shorter one. That didn't work either. The, there was not enough room for my hands and stuff. I got to uh, I gotta jack up the frame and get underneath. I know you got a shorter extension. I do. Yeah, we're gonna have to jack it up. I gotta jack up the I've side never of the frame took a one of these up. Like in this is all a bunch of shit I always avoid. <laughs> I never wanted my life to become traumatized. <laughs> if I had to do shit like that, I would have probably... Need my shit falling over. I have to start drinking. Right, now I get my hands underneath there, at least. Oh, you need a safety chance. That safety thing. Is this thing working? Well, no, see, it's on board that that trans mount should come undone. Listen, we should be able to crack this loose, man. Yo, come here. That's that's the spacer. We should be able to take this off, man. Me and you should be able to wobble this transfer case off. You hear me? So, did you, is it already off? Yeah, everything's undone. Oh, this should, don't, don't be, don't be, uh, don't hurt it. Oh, I'm gonna that jack with the jacks to see how it moved. Now watch when I pull it back up. Then you should be able to see how it separated. Yeah. Then you should be able to grab this. Take one of these apart. Yes. Oh, then you know what you're doing. I built many of these. Right, we gotta get the jack underneath the motor. Lift up a little bit. Pull pressure off of this. I'm gonna slide the jack on this side. I need the trans. Take all the weight off of the trans. Okay. Yeah, take it out completely. The trans oil is coming out, so there's nothing I can do about it. I'm gonna make a mess. There's no way I'm gonna get a thing underneath it. Yeah, I got it. Oh, you got kitty litter. Yeah. Oh, not really. It's for the kitty. Huh. Well, I'll just get some more. That works. Bags and bags and bags and bags. Oh, fuck. I'm gonna fuck that head up. Fuck. Fucking shit up. I have them in this thing. I have them. Frustrated, man, right now, kind of. I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna have to move that board. I had to move that fucking board. Let me pull that out from under there. So. Right. What happened? 
Nothing. It's not down too fast. Kitty. You gotta go back in the house, Kitty. Yeah, it'd be a good idea. I need to get hurt. I kind of wish I was here by myself. I ain't gonna lie. I really like working by myself. I think there's one more bolt underneath. Probably. You, you, know, you know these things, man. I've never seen them before. This is all new to me. I remember this guy was tearing yeah. apart the Ford I beam in the front. Oh, man. I learned my lesson. It's There's a bolt. So there's bolts going this way, there's one going that way. Underneath. I gotta remove this, which I already got I this. I gotta take this off. Is my ratchet over there? Did I leave that ratchet over there? I don't see nothing around here. You decided you grabbed it from me, Bill. <laughs> here it is. There it is. Four strange tools I've never seen. No? I've been isolated in a, in a certain time huh. zone and never, you know, like a time period where nothing, nothing changes. Small. It's the same time period. It's got to be a 12 or something. Probably a 13. I need to go grab my hat. It's driving me crazy. My hair. That's why I wear a hat all the time. Because of my long hair. It goes in my face. People always ask, why are you wearing a hat? If I can grow out your hair, you'll see why. I got, I got it. I found one. Alright. Thank you. Sure, man. No problem. Yeah. I gotta get this off so I can get to that fucking stupid ass fucking bolt. And the chance of this be off. And then I gotta figure out what it is soon and list it. I need money ASAP. I didn't go, I didn't go to, uh, I didn't walk to the, uh, to donate today, man. I didn't want to donate, man. I, I hate donating because every time I donate, I fucking, I'm, I'm out of energy the next day because they take all your plasma from you. Your humans can only produce plasma, plasma. We're the only living creature on this, in this world, in this earth that creates plasma, that makes plasma. And really? Yep. And these people that are dying of cancer and stuff, they need it. So every time I donate, you know, they, I'm helping a life, but I'm also killing myself. <laughs> your body needs that stuff. That's how you live a long life. Every time you donate... You're shortening your life. That's facts. Just so you know. So stop donating. Don't donate or you're going to shorten your life unless you can replenish it. Most people don't know how to replenish that stuff. They're not meditating. They're not dieting right. You know, they're not exercising. And then they're donating and doing drugs. They're not going to live a long life. They're going to die very fast. Because all that stuff that's in that plasma is what helps fight your immune system. This is why they're this is why they're farming all that stuff. All these people, all these rich people want that plasma. They're using that plasma to to, to have a better life. They're taking this medication and stuff, this special special medication. Don't take listen, man, don't there's shit going on people don't know, don't understand it. 
don't know really know what's happening around the world. And I'm gonna I'm gonna let everybody know and everybody's gonna understand these things because of me. No, it's just a bar. It's just it's really just it's a torque it's for a torque actually. It's we don't want to trip over anything. It's to also it's also to keep the exhaust from you know moving. Um, it's just a brace really. So I gotta get this bolt that's down here somewhere. That's right. Pain in the ass, let me tell you. It is. time getting to it unless I lift up the motor that's the only way I'm getting to this which means I got to get that bolt out I got to get this bolt out right here on this trans mount in order to get that other bolt out I have to there's no there's no questions I have to figure it out It, 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 that side's out. It, the yoke is, uh, the thing's out, but I can't, I had a hard time pushing this in. I should be able to take a hammer, knock this in a little bit, and it should come out. I didn't have a sledgehammer. I'm going to go grab my hat real quick, man. I'm going nuts. Oh, okay. You know, I'll be right back. Here, you want a rag? Better. There you go. I'm going nuts. Yeah, dude. you're all set now, Johnny. My hair keeps on going to my face. I can't stand it. to cut these heads off this fucking uh, exhaust system. Oh, here we are. Bye, bar. If you want to come help me, though, that'd be nice. Let's fuck me. Get busted. I don't need to cut myself from those bitches. You got a pair of fucking... That's how you take care of zip ties. Pull on them, you know? Yeah. There we go. I can go over there. It's on my way. Pry mm, bar ain't gonna really help me, Bob. You want some cutters? I need that sawzall. I need to get this, uh, I gotta get these heads off, this exhaust off. And these bolts are stripped out. Thanks. Sure, yeah, this is still a good way to
Bill, I asked you for a huge favor. You got any coffee at home, bub? What? Do you have any coffee at home? No, no. drop. I never touch the shit. No, I'm going to have to fuck it. I'm almost done. All I got to do, I'm going to show the camera. I'm about to go rob my neighbor tell him to give me fucking some more coffee. <laughs> so this bolt, this bolt stripped out right here. I got to finish cutting it. Um, That's the only one I got to cut. This one I should be able to get on. I, it started stripping out, but it's still good. This one is fully stripped out, rounded out. Um, I didn't want to put a pair of vice grips on it. It's, you know, it's heated, you know. The other ones I'll torch, you know, I'll heat up. They'll come off, but I got to finish cutting through. I'm halfway through. I need to find more caffeine. I ate three sandwiches, and I'm starting to feel I need food, you know. I need calories. <laughs> I got to eat. I'm gonna go uh, wash my hands and eat a little bit. Go for it, man. People don't understand is I don't eat very much throughout the day. Um, I fast a lot on purpose. Um, and I'm feeling lightheaded. I gotta eat. So, yeah, how are you gonna wash your hands? In the sink, <laughs> in my dishes, and I'm about to do my dishes tonight. Um, actually, I'm actually gonna go in the wash tub. Oh, there you go. That's an idea. You might shut that water off and go in my bed. Thanks. Alright. I'm gonna wash my hands too. I gotta eat something, man. I'm, uh, I'm feeling lightheaded. I know what it is, it's I gotta eat. I ate two sandwiches, but it's not enough. Uh. You want some uh, tea? I have plenty of tea. I need, what it is, man, is I'm used to caffeine. I'm used to drinking a pot of coffee and a lot of coffee. That's all. I, I never yeah, really that's all. any coffee. No, I'm going to go rob my neighbor. He already gave me some. But I'm, oh. it's, it's, I've only had a cup of coffee in that one little Red Bull. And I'm, I'm feeling funny. I got to have caffeine. That's what it is, too. I got to eat. I'm... I'm starting to feel shaky. I don't have enough sugar in my system and stuff. Oh, no. I gotta eat. I got to eat, that's all. I got to eat real quick, that's all. Um, that won't take long though. That won't take me long to get off. I, once I get that bolt off, those two bolts, the rest of it is easy sailing, smooth sailing. Oh, uh, shit. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go hit up old man real quick and bother him real quick. All right. He's gonna be pissed at me, but whatever. I don't give a fuck. I had to deal with this cat. Old man, come here. Let me get a little bit more mojo from you. I'll buy you some coffee in the morning, man. I'm fucking. I'm busting my ass off. I'm fucking busting my ass off right now getting this trans off. I need caffeine, my man. All my cats are left. Your kittens? They yeah, all died. No, I don't know. They left. You mean the other cats? The parents? All, all of them. They'll be back. I was uh, I fed them out in the garage this morning, the little ones, but I haven't seen them around. The little and ones? I don't know if they ate or not. But You're talking the, about the babies? No, the big ones out here in the back. They'll come on my back porch. I didn't take no big they cats. None, none of them are around there. I didn't take no big cats. There's one right here. I called. There was one here. Was, well, my cats would be on the porch or one. They come around. You know, it, it might be because the cats died, man. I hope they leave. Fuck them. A lot of the cats died. Is there dead cats? The light went on pretty good there. You got to remember, I buried I buried a bunch of cats over there. They probably smelled the other cats. Yeah. They probably smelled the other cats and left because they know they're no dying. I cats except the ones I'm feeding all the time. Well, they I found this morning, 
<laughs> put some in the garage. They're not in the garage. The, the little ones go in the garage, right. but I don't know if they can go in there anymore. So they can get through that that corner. The little ones can, but well, they go in there. I I go in there and leave a dish. I know they sleep and underneath. The food my... was gone this morning. They're probably hunting still. They're there, but the big ones on can't there. get in there. No, they sleep underneath my house though. They've been trying to get underneath my house, well, and I hear a... them. There was one here underneath your house too. Eat. When I fed my cat on the porch, he uh -huh. wouldn't come in. My asshole cat. Oh, Freddy! Freddy, lately. he's getting old. Freddy's getting old. He's getting fucking. He's old. getting old. He ain't old. Freddy's not old. He's Freddy. six years old. My white, my white. The white cat. The white and black one. Oh, you're th I'm thinking about the white one that always sits no. on your porch. I've seen a white one. Yeah, that's Hoochie Mama. I yeah. got blue. Well, you take well, all I just of fed my cat chicken. He, he ate a dish of food. Chicken? This is uh, Bill, by the way. This is my neighbor. He's uh, he's blessed me. Both of you guys have been helping me, man. This is a good guy right here, man. He's, he let me drive his truck, man. He let me drive that truck. You're on the internet, man. You're Say hello to everyone. Oh, isn't that neat? Yeah, you're on What's the internet. This? It's a joystick, oh, so... I thought it was a lens. No, it's a weight. It's a counterweight, because the phone, the head, the it's weight, uh, the balanced. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it helps yeah. balance the phone. Super. Um, Because there's technology in it that helps it stabilize, you know? Yeah. You see? Nice. Um, Actually, I'm really happy with it. I only paid 100 bucks for it. It's, it's like $200 for this. Um, I'm really happy with the you can company. Make, make all kinds of movies. Huh? Yeah, the company is actually really good. I'm surprised. Super. I'm uh, I'm actually doing a review, product review on I'm it. They don't know. I, I, I got all kinds of old. I have to check VCRs it out. VCRs and bullshit. Oh and yeah, I you're my man. Movies, all my trips, some oh, bullshit. Yeah? yeah. That's awesome. I that, all kinds of that crap. I that's probably really expensive back then, man. Well, I have a camera on note. I've got. I've yeah, I've seen your cameras. I bet you could probably find 50 cameras in I, my I've garage and house here. And we'll have to talk. We'll have to talk. Maybe yeah. maybe if you want to unlo unload some of the but stuff, I'll buy some stuff. I need yeah. camera equipment. Yeah. I'm gonna be uh, I'm gonna be uh, documenting global warming well, and these uh, are VCR, the little the well, small VCR. Well, I'll know. be. Well, come and look, cause that stuff is useful still. Yeah. You can you can cause a lot of I got a lot of older stuff. I'm gonna be like uh, converting from analog to digital. Mm -hmm. You know, like those old videotapes, like yeah. wedding tapes and stuff. You know, people from the 90s that got married. I kind of got out of it now because, but I had, a, I used to be. Really into that? that? Yeah, I could see that. I've got cameras in the garage, boxes huh. of cameras. You got a lot of stuff in there. You should see this guy's garage. 35. Jeez. Really? You got a lot in the garage, yeah. right? Everybody has, and up here too, I got a lot, lot up in that upstairs. <laughs> oh, let me get some coffee from you. That's we what need, I came over for. I need some coffee. Some more? Yeah, I'm I'm about to bring you some tomorrow. Come on, man. You know I'm good for it. You got pots. You got fucking. You got you got. You got a whole kilo in here. You got a whole kilo of caffeine in here. Eighteen fucking. You got a whole thing up here still. I know. I'm gonna bring it to you. I I just I got. I'm gonna be up on that. I bring you. I got the one. I got the jar you gave me. I'll bring the other jar back. I'll be back. He said, I don't want jars. Fuck right. Fucking jar. I, hey, you know, you know, fuckers away. You know, I know how you are, man. I know her. That's why I came over and get you already have one open, Bubba. I, I need coffee, man. I'm used to drinking a pot a day and I'm trying to cut down. It's a bad habit. Drink this much. It's two cups. Two cups? That's what I need to do. But I drink. I uh, made this all once or twice, and I never. So mine goes I to four need, ounces. I don't need that much coffee. I drink about eight ounces. I drink. I drink two of these a day. Yeah. Not that one. But I appreciate you, man. He's a, I know I'm driving you crazy. You're supposed to be watching TV, relaxing, and I'm over here asking you for coffee. I I gotta have uh, some coffee, man. It's been frustrating not having this vehicle. That's why I'm trying to get this engine in the truck. My dad uh, kind of screwed me over. I helped him buy that uh, EcoBoost truck, and then he dips out on me. So I've had no view. That's plenty, man. That'll last me till tomorrow now. He's like, I don't want you coming back over here. <laughs> That's what that is. I appreciate you, bro. You got a scoop? Yeah, I got that. I'm going to pour half that jar in the coffee maker. What you mean? This is Half of this is getting made tonight. I'm going to be up all night. Oh, boy. I promise you, half of this is going in my coffee maker, and I'm gonna drink it, and I'm gonna be up to two, three in the morning working. Okay. 
I appreciate you. I, I love you, old man, and I will see you tomorrow, man. Okay. All right? Well, as soon as I earn some cash, I know you will. You're 93 years old. You're going to live another 93. Really? I uh, definitely got to get some money then. What's up, young blood? You all right? You famous now, man. You're on camera. Smile, man. All right. All right. Let's go, uh, coffee. My house is open. Good thing I have Bill around. Thank, uh, thanks for watching my house, Bill. Sure, you know, I don't, I don't, it's not a good thing I'm leaving my house open with weaponry. See, <laughs> he said, I don't want you coming back. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you, listen, that's how you get free coffee. You bug the shit out of your neighbors. Yeah. That's how you do it. I'm telling you, it works. It's better to be a bug than, than, than not to be a bug. And I'm a bug. I learned from the best. I learned from the bugs in prison. Listen, man, you learn a lot watching people, man. Listen, <laughs> I learned a lot of fucking, I can be a slime ball, bro. You want to push me? You push me? I've been pushed. Listen, man, I've been pushing the situations you don't want to, you don't ever want to be in. Don't put yourself in those positions, man. Listen, I'm fucked up here, man. I'm fucked up. I'm fucked up. Only one as good as Jesus. You hear me? Listen, I got problems. Half of us just went into the fucking coffee machine. I got problems, bro. What do you want, Matora? You have food. You've been eating good. You got fucking meat. I'm gonna give her some cat food. Alright, that's on. Alright. I gotta chug the rest of this. I need fluids, man. I need, I need. Listen, I slept half the day. <laughs> I didn't, I ate, I barely ate today, you know. Um, I've been kind of fucked up, man. I ain't gonna lie, I'm fucked up. If it wasn't for Bill and my neighbor, and, um, you know, I've, I've been fucked up. My hands clean. I just need, really, I just need coffee, caffeine. I feel. I feel fucked up. I need water. I got a chug of water. My head's pounding, man. I need lemons. That's what it is. That's what it is, man. Water, caffeine. I'll be good on food for a second. I'm gonna eat banana in a minute. Um, Nantora's good. She that's mostly water actually. I put milk in it for her. She can she can eat the meat. I'll give her a cat food later. She's she's eight. We gotta get back to work. Oh, man. What's up? The man, you got your hat on. Do I? Don't forget your hat. Yeah, I don't know where I put it. Gotta have your hat, man. Yeah, before my hair goes in my face. I gotta put this up before I get it chopped up. That hat saved me, actually. This hat's gone everywhere. My uncle gave me this hat. I gotcha. Thanks. Sure My uncle hat. gave me this hat, huh? That's a cool looking hat, man. I love it. Makes you look real. All right. I'm happy I got caffeine coming. I drank a bottle of water and chugged the rest of that coffee, so I should be good in a minute. Cool. Now I'm gonna eat a banana. Do that.
You're cutting them nuts off, aren't you? Uh, there's no more uh, blade on the front. I gotta try to get back. I just need to get that one nut off. It's stripped out. There's no need to. I gotta get it off of this. cutting wheel and I think it's down the street at the neighbor's house at the corner. I let them use it and I never brought it back. Hmm. Yeah, I need a different blade. That blade's done. It's, it's purple. Huh. Um, I'm out of blades actually. Big one. Unless, I know you threw a lot of them out. Might be a yeah. Ooh, you really, really short. I keep everything, man. I have tools, man. I, I ran a business. I, people, people, I don't know why people always judge, you know. Uh, I've had problems, man. Like, people just, they judge a book by, they look at me and they think I'm somebody I'm not. I don't know what it is. I and don't know until I see. That's true. I mean, uh, that's uh, very true. That's why I show everyone. Ryan, right. That's why I show everyone. Yeah, Ryan. I don't know. And the looks of it, he knows how to strip a truck. Yeah. I know how to build it too. He didn't come that way. Somebody stripped it. Yeah. It wasn't, wasn't, wasn't the cats. Nope. guy's wife calls me up horsing around on a drunk. I said, where, where, where is, uh, where's your husband? Oh, he in jail. He tried to cut off my head. <laughs> that seems to be popularity for, for husbands and wives. That's just American way. It's just, uh, the, you guys got any, you got any vehicles you want? Uh, I got his truck. <laughs> you want to sell it? Yeah, I'll sell it. Uh, 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 you got the title? Yeah, matter of fact, it's in my name. I'll sell it to you right now. Hard box. I got me right <laughs> I'll over. be right there. Yeah, we big uh, rusted up old GMC. Take it apart. Totally rotted out, but it had a, a, a big block in it. That's how you make your money, man. So I gave her a hundred bucks, had my buddy follow me home. Yeah. Sold it, sold the engine and trans for 300 bucks. Made money, that's good. I still got the radiator. You still got the radiator, brand new. You still, I might have still to, you got a radiator? Man. Four core radiator. I might need GMC. it. I need it. Four core radiator. I need it. these do the work you know you're not supposed to push hard on them but these blades are already done they were already used blades they're not new most of them are already dead yeah. 
And that black truck with that camper on it, that's a 68 Chevy. Yeah. And it's got a 79 whole front suspension wheeled right on the there. Disc brake suspension. You say had drums. Drums? I wonder yeah. how much it costs. Six lug wheel drum. Now it's got three quarter ton drum. Uh, three quarter ton. I think I found one, fellas. That's a big brake. That's a big. Uh... Yeah, and then I got a, a 1970 rear axle, three quarter or one three ton. Three quarter, one ton. One ton axle on the camper special on the. What do you know? What gear it is? No, I don't know. What gear so I'm looking. Oh, I'm looking. It's a tractor gear. <laughs> done in the middle. I need to go get my wheel and my wheel cutter from the neighbors. That's what I need to do. Uh huh. Which tells you, you got that... more blades? What's funny, I do. Yeah, I grab this one. yeah. What's funny you is you'd think they would man. bring it back knowing that they have my tool. And they've had it for almost a month now. No, they're gonna keep it, thinking I'm not gonna ever come back for it. I don't know. This guy powered my damn tow bar. Stupid. Hate people like that. Yeah, finally. After they stole something. Yeah. They, they, then he had to have heart surgery. Huh. So I went to his shop, man. I just give him my damn tow bar, man. He I wanted to. Drop down. Of course. They need the tool more than I do. through the pipe I don't that bolt is not coming through what brand thing what brand sauce all is that that's not the sawzall it's a big sawzall sawzall is not what matters it's a blade so if blades are good blades it's just they're old I I use them already these are all old blades if I had a brand new blade it'd go right through and my dad fucking I had a stash of them for my old work and my fucking ignorant dad 
kept on using them. Well, I'll buy you new ones. I'll buy you new ones. All right, Dad. Do I see new ones? No. Did he ever buy me new ones? No. He fucking left like a fucking piece of shit. I'll go get you one. I got these little ones. Oh, you got some? Yeah, these. But these are going to help you. Fuck. Yeah, I'm going to need ones, though. I go get one. I appreciate it, man. I got them in my face, man. I, I, I have some somewhere. Yeah. I keep those. I bought. I buy those red ones from Milwaukee. My dad. I'm pretty sure my dad used them all. Yeah. For a stupid ass scrap. cutting wheel I found a cutting wheel a small one um I don't know if I'm gonna have I think I gave my small cutter to uh my neighbor across the street and I think my other wheel won't fit the one my neighbor has the only thing I could think of is possibly put in that cutter I might be able to put this on the drill Might be able to put this in there. If I can find something. About to find out. Listen, my dad fucking used all my fucking red, all my red sawzall blades, my Milwaukee fucking sawzall blades. Promise me he's gonna fucking bring new ones, buy new ones, he's using the fucking scrap. They never listen. Nobody ever does what they tell you they're gonna do. Ever. It's so fucking annoying. There's sway bar links for my truck. These are Moog sway bar links. These ain't cheap. These are fucking $30, $40 a pop. These gotta go in the truck before they get lost. My sway bar links snapped. I bought them for the truck. That side snapped. I never put them on. Never had a chance to put them on yet. Not only did I snap the trans, I snapped the spacer from the trans on Silver Lake Sand Dunes. I snapped fucking the sway bar link as well. So I bought new sway bar links with, you know, Moog sway bar links. Um, just haven't had a chance to put them on. They're going on. <laughs> I bought everything to put this truck together, including the motor. Everything's here for the most part, other than the wire harness and the Haltech. Um, I was going to run this, this trans. Everything was going to go in with the Haltech system, but... Change of plans. This thing's gotta come out tonight. I don't have a choice. So, there's gloves. Good thing Bill has sawzall blades downstairs in his basement. Otherwise, I'd be fucked. I would, I'd be fucked. So, um, I'm, when he gets back, I'm cutting the, I'm going to cut through here, boom. I'm going to cut the other side through there. It eliminates this exhaust out of my way. I can get to that fucking everything, pull that half shaft off. This can come off. I'm tired of it being in my way. It's getting in my way. I want it done. I got to get that off and get this trans off tonight and get it listed tonight for tomorrow. Um, that way, tomorrow, Monday, Tuesday, hopefully by Tuesday it's gone. Hopefully it's gone by tomorrow. Um, you know, hopefully bring somebody brings me, you know, 12, 1200, 1500 bucks. I'm listing this for 1500 bucks. That's how much, just this alone. This is what's getting listed for 1500. This will sell before that most likely. I'm going to, I'm going to figure out what I'm doing with this. I want to keep this possibly. I might end up keeping the transfer case, but this is what's getting sold right away. Um, it's a good transmission, only 40,000 miles on it. That's where all my money's at. Uh, that's gonna put money in my pocket. I'll take 1,200 right away. I won't take anything less than 1,200. It only has 40,000 miles on it. People says I won't pay for that unless you prove documentation. Guess what? Go buy yourself another transmission. I don't give a fuck. You're not touching this transmission for less than 1,200 bucks. You're not walking out of this driveway unless you hand me 12 $100 bills. It's getting listed for 1,500. 
Um, you know, that I'm going to probably keep depending on if I can use it or not. I have to figure everything out. Um, I'm going to be trying to put it behind my transmission, um, the Turbo 400 if I can or whatever I can figure out. Um, if it's possible, I might, I might not. I might just go two-wheel drive. I don't know yet. I got to get all the stuff first off first. I got to get this sold and get money in my pocket. Because so I got I to gotta pay bills. I'm looking to pay my internet bill, my power bill. I want to give Bill a couple dollars for helping me. And then, um, you know, that I'll have, I'll have a couple hundred, you know, I'll have 800 bucks to play with. You know what I mean? Um, for, for parts. So, um, I'll have to, I'm going to start looking for a manifold, a used manifold and a, a used, uh, fuel injection system to swap over this. And then I got to find headers. Um, I'm going to be looking for all these parts for basically I'm selling the transmission to buy all the other parts that I need to get this engine in the truck and buy some groceries and live the diff as well. That diff is getting sold as well. It's a 410 diff with only 40,000 miles on it. Um, you know, and that's a 2,500 diff. People are using those every day. Um, you know, snowplow trucks, all that shit. That, that diff is worth a lot of money. That's, that's getting listed too. I got to see how much you're going for on Facebook. I haven't looked it up yet. I'm assuming they're going anywhere from three to five hundred. That's what I'm assuming. If the trans is going for a thousand and up, you know, um, you know, I'm talking transes that have sixty, seventy thousand miles. You know, they're going for twelve hundred thousand. This only has forty thousand on it. Um, same with the diffs. So that's why it ain't leaving this house for less than twelve hundred. And it will. It will sell. That will be gone. People need these all day long. People drive these all day long. These are work trucks. This is one of the most desirable Chevy motors out there. That's why it would be gone. That transmission is a heavy-duty transmission. It's not a 4L60. A 4L60 is for light-duty trucks, for passenger trucks. This is for this is for a work truck. This is a heavy-duty transmission. This is was made. It's a hydromatic. It's based off the 4L60E. It's you know the 4L60. 4L60s are the predecessor, the hydromatics. It's still a hydromatic. It's just called a 4L80E. You know, they have so many different variations and stuff, you know. Basically, all it is is a hydromatic from the 50s, which they've made it better. And they, you know, electronic ignition. You know, everything's electronically controlled, which made it more efficient in the 90s, which now, you know, it's newer. It's the 2002. and the 2000s, they... Listen, this is a really good mess. This, this is amazing. This, this trans is really good. People love these things. People hate them as well, but people love them. Um, and it hasn't been, it's never been cracked open. It's never, you know, it's a factory transmission, factory sealed unit. That's why it's worth the 1200 That's why it's not leaving this house for less than $1,200. Um, yeah. So I'm waiting on Bill to get back with uh, Sawzall. So... I'm going to go ahead and upload this. Um, it's an hour, 15, 16 minute video. Um, I'm going to go finish this coffee, drink this coffee and stuff. Um, I'm going to go check up on the cat. Um, and then, uh, you know, I'll finish this tonight. We'll get this off tonight. That's what we're doing. So, you know, and then uh, before I go to bed, we'll do, we'll do a, a, you know, a passage in the Bible and then that'll be it. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. All right.